In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to add Google Maps into our Canva design, specifically Canva website. So this will work for you who already publish your Canva website and you would like to add a location inside of your website. You can do it with a pre-made website that you've already created or if you just want to create one from scratch, these steps are also going to work just fine. So I am going to try and take a look at Canva website templates and choose one of them. This one catches my eye, so I think I'm going to use this first. So I'm going to go ahead and click customize this template. Now I'm going to show you several ways in which you can add the Google Maps into your website. The first one is by going back to your Canva home. And if you notice, whether it's going to be on top of your screen around here or on the navigation menu on the left side of the screen, mine appears to be placed over here. You can see this apps option. So you're going to want to click on it and you're going to want to click on the search bar right here and you can go ahead and search for Google. Now you, there will be some other Google apps appearing here. We've got Google Photos, Google Ads, Google Maps, Google Drive, etc. But the one that we're going to be using is going to be this Google Maps one. So you can go ahead and click on it. And again, you will be able to see a bunch of other apps that you can use, but we're going to be using this one today. And if you click on it, you will have two options, which is using it in existing design, or you can use it in new design. So this is why I told you that whether you already created your website, or maybe you just want to create one from scratch right now, it doesn't matter, it will work either way. I'm going to use this in existing design and I'm going to go ahead and search for the project that I've just choose, which is this one's right here. So I'm going to go ahead and click on it and it's going to open my homepage website. All right. As you can see, the Google Maps apps appears on the left side of the screen, just like how if you're going to open your elements or your upload, your text, etc. And I'm just going to scroll down a little bit and try to find a page where I want the Google Maps to appear. So let's say I want to appear in this page right here. I'm just going to change this to find us here. And I'm also going to delete the one below it. I'm going to ungroup this real quick. Delete this, then delete the rest of the other thing. And I'm going to put this like so. All right. And then I'm also going to try to find the location. So if you want to search for your exact location, you can just type in your address right there. Or you can also search for the name. Let's say you have an interior store or something like that. I'm going to try and search for that kind of shop. Let's search for furnish and see what we can find. All right, so I found one with the name of furniture furnish. I think I'm going to be using this one's right here. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the result. And as you can see, I got the Google Maps inserted right here and I can adjust the size of the maps and then I can also click on the plus sign here to zoom in and I can click on the minus sign to zoom out like so which is going to be very very helpful and now I got the Google Maps added into my website now, the second way in which you can add your Google Maps into your design is by going to the app section here on the left side of the screen. And you can just do it like how I showed you earlier. You can type in Google Maps right here. And it's also going to show you the exact same thing like when we search it through our home page. So again, you can click on this Google Maps and it's going to open the apps like so. 
Now let's try and check whether this is going to work or not. So I'm just going to go ahead and publish the website and then I'm going to go ahead and click publish now. And now we wait until it's finished publishing. All right, I'm going to go ahead and try and take a look at the website. And this is how it looks like. I'm not going to focus too much into the content of the website. I'm just going to show you how things will work if you're trying to add Google Maps into your website. So this is the address that I chose earlier. And again, you can play around with the zoom in as well as the zoom out button. And you can even click view larger map to redirect you to the Google Maps link and it's going to bring you right here. Or you can also click on this red symbol to see the full address of your location. Now, you have to take note that before you'll be able to add your address from Google Maps to your website, you're going to have to register your business to Google or else you might not be able to find the specific location or you might not be able to find the exact name to your business because you haven't registered it to Google yet. So make sure you pay attention to that. Now I'm going to try to search for a new address. So let's say I want to search it by the address name. Here I'm just going to search for Kana Interior, which is one of the brand of furniture or interior shop here. So I'm going to Try to see if this will work if I inserted not the name, but the full address. All right, so I got the address right here and I'm going to try to copy all of this into the Google Apps on Canva and we'll see if it will work. So this brings me to an address but I don't think that this is what I'm searching for because it looks quite different from the one I added. I'm gonna try and um, shortening the address and we'll see if it's going to read according to how I want it to be. Alright yeah so it's still not reading it as how I want it to be so I think if I search for the name of the store, it's going to show. So this is exactly what I'm searching for. Again, this is one of the brand of a furniture shop here. So just like how I said earlier, you're going to have to register your business address and your business name first onto Google or else you might be having quite a hard time to put Google Maps into your website. And every time you create some changes, don't forget to click Publish Website and click on Republish the website. And don't forget to always check whether the Maps is already upgraded or not. So it's still loading right here. But once you'll be able to see the upgraded maps, make sure that it is the right location that you want. And that's basically it. That is how you can add Google Maps into your Canva website. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.